my check engine lights on and they said it's going to cost $800 to change my catalytic converter on my car. Yep. And when they do, they're going to change this whole thing out because it's one big piece. And you're looking at that and you're going, whoa, how do you do that? It's easy. At Rat Trap Productions, we show you how to do stuff. Today, I'm going to show you how to change out a catalytic converter and accompanying exhaust system on a late 90s, early 2000s, four-cylinder Toyota Camry or Camry Solera. Save yourself 800 bucks. Do it. So this catalytic converter costs $177 online. You just go online, no problem. Um, catalytic converter, make sure you write in, uh, you know, uh, what your car make is and all that stuff. And you can get this piece. You also are gonna need two gaskets, special gaskets, one for here and one for up here, okay? They wanted to charge, I think it was about 850 bucks to change this thing out at the dealership and so for less than two hundred dollars i did it myself and i'll show you how to do it easy first thing we're going to do is get ourselves a little patience we are going to spray this entire thing with rust bomb which basically loosens metal i'm going to just spray the entire thing really get it coated I'm also going to spray up there to get those pieces as well. And then we're going to let it sit for a little bit. Don't be shy. So we got to somehow coax this off without busting it. And good luck with that. <clears throat> Woo. You use a little scientific thing called leverage. I'm going to put this piece of tube here to make this longer and we'll try to get it off that way. Yeah. Looks like we're just going to round stuff off. Let's try the next thing. Mm. Uh. Wow. Sometimes you have to get a little creative with how you remove things. So, what I ended up doing for these guys, right here and right here, is I took my chisel, air chisel, and I chiseled the engine side. See, this is the back rear wheels, okay? This is the engine side. The engine side has two Crappy little, little bolts look like this, okay? So what you do is you chisel those apart like that. And then the bolts slide out towards the back wheels. Boom, boom. that one's out. Now let's get the top front of the engine here as much. See the three bolts? There's one. They're copper kind of colored. Yeah, one, two, three in a triangle. So I just got to remove those bolts. So as you can see, this piece came off fairly easily. The problem is there's a bunch of residue on there too. You're going to need to get all of that off as well. So Get your screwdriver, start scraping. Yeehaw. All right, so that's about as good as I'm gonna get it. So now what I'm going to do is put the whole thing on. You will notice right here, I have taken off the holder. Holders like this right here. It holds on the exhaust, but lets it move freely. Um, and they're just bolted on with two 12 millimeter bolts right here. 
I just decided it was easier to take the whole thing off, put it up, and then bolt this as the first point of attachment. So that's what I'm going to do. Get on there. I got my bolts on there. Ready to go. Because the flange, there's a little bit of a gap, so I'm tightening it up evenly on both sides. And kind of feel it. Truck Productions. I'll show you how to do stuff. Today I showed you how to change out a catalytic converter and accompanying exhaust system on a late 90s, early 2000s Toyota Camry. Four banger. Chakra.